Hi, I'm Anastasia and today we will do a minimalistic geometrical design. For this design I will be using Modelone's gel polishes, so the collection come in a box, we communicate the world with color. I like their slogan as well as the packaging. So as far as I understood the cap of the bottle is wooden so it is recyclable and I also like the look of the bottles itself but I think you need to be very careful so the cap will not be dirty in the gel polish so it will always look tidy. So we have seven colors in collection and for this design I will be using cocoa black, also I'll take Africa white, Brazil red, Fiji blue, and dreamy silver. So these colors refer to Traveler's collection. First I will take Cocoa Black to create a thin black lines. I am using Synthetic Brush Zero, so this is the smallest brush that I have. And I have to admit that the color is pretty intense. As you can see, the one layer of the black I think will be enough here. So I am trying to create a thin lines, but they don't have to be like super thin. Some of them, like on the middle finger, we decided to make it slightly wider. And once you need to fix it, just feel free to do this. Also, I have a buffed surface of the nail, so once any line goes wrong, simply take cleanse or any other liquid and remove it and then draw it again. Just make sure that the surface is dry. On the thumb, I will add a little bit more lines as it's bigger, one right here and another one right here and then we will need to cure it in LED for one minute. Now let's add some colors. So first I will take a dreamy silver and add it on a pinky. And honestly, when I first saw this color, I thought it's like watery glitter, but now we can see that it's pretty intense, so it's even good for making designs, not only for the full coverage. So then I freeze cure it for about 5 seconds and continue working with another color. So Brazil red is like dark brownish red, it's not like classic red, and this color is also pretty intense. I create another geometrical object here, freeze cure it, you don't have to fully cure each color, and then I take the Fiji blue. This color is so beautiful, but it is not as intense as other colors, so I had to make it slightly thicker. As you can see, I add additional layers to make it look blue. It's a little bit transparent, which is okay for some applications or designs, but for the full coverage you will definitely need at least two layers. So I create another geometrical figure right here. And then again, I will simply freeze cure it for 5 seconds. The reason I freeze cure every color is I just want to make sure that they will stay there. Now I'm taking Africa White and honestly I am impressed. This color is very intense, which is rare when you're working with gel polishes. Usually the gel paints are as intense, it even looks like one layer will be enough here, which is valuable for white color. So I'm adding white right here on index finger and then again freeze cure and also we need to add some colors on the thumb. So I decided to use two colors here, the first one will be dreamy silver, I put it right in the corner. Sometimes it's tricky doing designs with the glitter, so just make sure that they're not too thick because we might end up with the design that will not look very flat. And the other color I'm using is Brazil Red and I totally love this color. It's so bright and so intense. So I add it right here near the free edge and now we need to fully cure it for one minute in LED. And I decided to add additional layers, so now I will simply fast outline each color just to make them pop and to make them more intense. So here with silver and blue we definitely need another layer to make them brighter, but other colors I think they would look okay even without the second layer.
Do not forget to fully cure the second layer as well and the last step will be sealing with the top coat. And by the way, I'm using the top coat by Valentino as well as the color on the bottom. This is Glamorous Nude. I think this color works best for this client. And I'm using No Cleanse Wipe Coat. I really like this one because you simply apply it, cure, and your client is good to go. And as we have designed here, also do not forget to be careful when applying it near the free edge. And I have acrylic nails, so we don't have to cap the free edge, but you can also do this if you have design very close to the free edge. So after application, we need to fully cure it. Usually it's one minute in LED. And that's it. When it's cured, we are finished. And here's our minimalistic design. Honestly, I thought I was going to get inspired with some abstract picture like paintings by Kandinsky, but I ended up creating my own. You can create any kind of figures, just play with the lines, with the colors, use triangles or circles instead, and every time you will get a different picture. Thank you guys so much for watching. If this is your first time here, consider subscribing as I post nail art tutorials every week. Thank you and see you in my next videos. Bye-bye!